Hi guys, um, welcome back to Ndibuti and Pastor Bay, and I am Ndibuti, as I am, natural, beautiful lady, you know. I decided to go to come to the car because my kids are literally always following me, non-stop. They follow me, guys, they even follow me in the bathroom, when I'm in the toilet, when, just when I think I'm just going to get like 10 minutes now just to be myself. They follow me. And I just wanted to do an update video. I've never done it before, but I just felt like I needed to pour my heart out. Because I feel like there's just a lot of things that um, God is doing in my life. And God is requiring from me. And it's a lot. Like, it's a lot. It's a lot. The changes, the closing down of my businesses. Whew, like, kuningi, kuningi. I didn't even want to do this video with Pastor Bay because... He was literally going to be trying to make fun of every little thing that I'm going to say because that's just how he is. He doesn't like taking things serious because he doesn't want to get emotional, obviously. You know, people that always make people laugh, always people that are always trying to... Oh, my nails are beautiful, guys. Yeah. Um, People that are just trying to... People that are always trying to make other people laugh, acting like a clown, it's because they go... Now they go through a lot, Shem. So, yeah, I wanted to do an update video, but it seems like I won't be able to because there's literally somebody... Look. Look look the other one is there i think he's scratching his foot what do you want guys so uh so uh we, we, we we're just here huh we're just here to do what to, to sit with you <laughs> see what i meant you can come in okay like it's never it, it's not gonna happen it is never it's not gonna happen like look they followed me i can't believe that i carried these people and now it's just little humans following me around everywhere <laughs> like guys why do you follow me everywhere because we love Theo? because we love you you're funny you're you're kind you're kind and you're a loving mother you you spoil us you know there's many reasons Sometimes oh. you don't even want to go to school. Because you want to spend time with me? Yeah. Uh -huh. Now I feel bad because I was like, I was complaining. But yeah, Ethan, why are you following me around? Because we love you. Because, oh. because, because you carried us in your womb. <laughs> you even know my womb. You were <laughs> staying in my womb. And you know, what, what the funny thing is that I couldn't wait to get rid of you. To, to, to get out of my womb. Like, I literally faked contractions with this one. With Theo, I went to... I was going for checkup. Now, the video is just taking another 10. Because obviously, so, I can't do an update video. And also, because sometimes you say we, we must not go to school. Because, because you want to spend time with us. I do miss you a lot. And sometimes, I just want to be with you guys. But sometimes, And you also play board games with us. Mm -hmm, and but every, almost every day. Yeah. So okay, let me just change. Let me let me change this video and make it how I gave birth to both of them, right? So it was both um C section. So with Theo, right? Uh Theo, I went for a checkup. I think it was 35 or 36 weeks. So when I got there, the the guy name was like, no, there's an umbilical cord around his neck. And then he said, um, I need to go to theater right the same day i shouldn't go back home and that was the day that i actually fought with his dad in that office because my husband was like no babe we've been praying for the past eight months for a natural birth just because the doctor is saying that now it's going to be a c-section let's not agree to it but the guy was like if you don't agree to this then that means you're gonna give birth to a stillbirth stillborn whatever at least they don't know what is that so that's cool and I was like, what? My husband was like, babe, God is God. God will do it at the right time. Just wait. Let's wait for the due date. That was the day that I said, no, I am not going home. And my best, my husband left me there. <laughs> no, I, I think I should tell the story when he's there so that you can see his reaction. He, le he left me at the hospital and he went home and said he's going to pray. And God is going to change my mind. And, and, and. But the bottom line is that on that day, hours later, I gave birth to him and um pastor b was there in the after delivery how much room. Man, so, so with him 
I just couldn't take it anymore. I was so, so, so tired. So I went to the hospital and I said, I'm feeling contractions. And then they took me to that machine. I had already Googled how to fake the contractions. I did it. But like, oh my God, this is so abnormal. Because that thing was just, because I would put my, I will let it do, 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 do. Then I'll put my thumb there. Then it would do that thing. And then they said, oh, this is abnormal. Then they called my guy. No, we think she's going to deliver a, a natural birth. And we don't want that because of the rapture. Because I had given birth to him. Six session, don't, don't, blah, blah, blah. And then I also needed to do the um, tubal ligation to tie my, my tubes. So the guy had to drop everything. Come, wheel me over to the theater. And I was like, no, wait, wait, wait. My husband is on his way. Wait, wait. They're like, no, we can't wait for him. Like, wait. Like, I wish I could just say, hey, I was just faking it. You know, but I couldn't. But luckily, he got the first because it was just like five minutes drive from my house. It was in Develchus, yeah, Develchus Hospital in um, Pretoria East, next to the Grove Mall, if you know it. That's where the two boys were born. So, yeah, then I gave birth to him and I started stressing, like, what if, what if he's not okay? What if he's not, you know, because it was still, he was a premature and I just, I just couldn't, I just couldn't for some reason. But then he came, a beautiful, healthy baby boy. And he was, I think he was weighing 3.5. And Theo, I think he was 4, almost 4 kg. A premature as well. But that one was not a planned premature. This one was a planned one. But here they are. You know, my babies. I just thought of it when they said they love spending time with me. Maybe it's because the way they spend a long time in my womb as well. And maybe I'm just fun. Am I fun? Mm -hmm. Am I a cool mom? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So now... I just gotta sit with them because we're here now, right? Yeah. Okay. Is it nice? Pastor Bay is is building stuff. Yeah, we went out to Mr. Price home and we were buying some stuff for the setup, the chairs, the flowers. And yeah, so he's busy assembling the stuff there. That's why I thought this would be the perfect time for me to just, you know, and run away from everybody. I thought they would be with their dad fixing stuff and whatever, but I know that he probably said, Go, go, go away. Don't do this, don't do, do, don't touch, don't do one, two, three, one, two, three. No, he didn't say that. Okay, so tell me, or tell people, what kind of parents are we? Are we okay? cool parents? Are we cool parents? Yeah. Mm -hmm. What do you cool. love about us, Ethan Stutt? That uh, you guys always play board games with us, and you always, and since it's school holidays, you always call us to watch movies with you guys and eat popcorn. Mm -hmm. And... And we play board games. Mm -hmm. And when we go to car washes, we also play board games. And we ride bikes and we go out for shopping sprees. And they bought us our own debit cards. Okay, we don't, we don't buy. <coughs> I'm thirsty. <coughs> I'm we don't so buy. Mm, we're going to go get my water. Uh, we don't buy debit cards. I opened an account for you. So they each have their own accounts. Are they here? <laughs> Nope. No. We have them in your room. Okay, that's fine. So they've got their Why own accounts. That's where I save their there? money. Where is it? Oh, it's somewhere there. Like it is there. So they've got their own debit card, whatever they call them. Debit card. And it's cool in a card. Yeah, whenever they want to buy stuff, they use their own cards. But it's so cute when we go to the shops and they're like, no, I've got this much in my account. Can I buy these? Can I buy these? In my accounts, hmm? I actually have 700. Hmm? Okay, I've just been venting, blabbling a lot because these guys are here. But yeah, I think it's time to go now. Say Toodles. bye. Toodles. 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 Hi. What's up? I mean, it looks like my hand is on your head. Yeah.